Christmas is coming. Hi there everyone, it's Misty here from The Joy Fit Off. Happy Monday, welcome to today's video. Boy howdy y'all, I got a lot <laughs> to tell you about. And I am looking really fly with my cute little Rudolph glasses and my little um, headband. So we're going to talk about the holiday card series, which is coming, but first I have a couple other things I need to talk to you about. So hopefully you can take me seriously because I love these glasses and I don't want to take them off just yet. But anyway, number one, I have decided to shut down my Patreon. So if you are a patron and you haven't checked your messages, please make sure you do so. I want to make sure that I get everybody a gift out in the mail um, just as a thank you. Unfortunately, I have the best of intentions and just I don't have the ability to follow through as much as I would like to. And it's not fair for those of you who support me over there to not reap the benefits of what I wanted that to be. And I, and I recently, like the 1st of September, just changed rewards and everything like that. And I just realized that it's just not something that I can do. Especially like this past week where you guys didn't get any videos from me. And I'll explain that in just a minute. But I don't want to overpromise and not be able to deliver. So I am disbanding that. And we'll talk about something else that I want to do instead in just a minute. But that's probably the first thing that I need to tell you about. I mean, I did that because one of the things I want to do and what I talked about in my why I'm leaving Stampin' Up or why I've left Stampin' Up for good video is that I want to foster more close relationships with you guys and foster more of a community over here on this channel. So it's really important to me to not over promise something that I can't deliver on. So um, it'll probably be the end of the month by the time I get everything cleared off and completely shut down. But yeah, I'm no longer no longer going to be active on Patreon. Which leads me to the next thing I've been kind of considering and you guys will have to let me know. Um, one of the things I was offering as a um, tier reward was one on one, one hour live streams. So how that would work is the beginning of each month, beginning of each month, blah, 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 beginning of each month, I would have you know maybe probably five slots available for people to sign up to do a one-on-one -on -one live stream. Um, it would probably be around thirty dollars, and um, in that one hour, you and I could just sit and chit chat and craft. We could, it could be where I'm teaching you a technique where we're crafting together. Um, it could be something a bit more serious or it could be just, you know, fun hanging out. It'll really be up to whoever signs up. It will be limited. It will be first comes first serve. It will be open internationally. Um, all those things. It's just something that I'm kind of playing around with in my head and would love to get your feedback. Now, there are going to be some of you who are completely opposed to the idea and that's okay because that's not going to take away anything from this channel. It's going to be something that is additional in a way for people who want to support me um, can monetarily and not have to, um, like I won't have to try to keep up with like too many irons in the fire, however you want to say it. So that is something that I'm considering. Again, I haven't quite made a final decision. Um, it wouldn't be something that you have to sign up for every month. It could be a one-time thing. Um, like I said, it's something that I'm considering and we'll talk more about it um, in the future. Just let me know if that's something that you're interested in. <clears throat> the next thing I'm also considering is a subscriber mystery box. So I watch a couple of artists and even a couple of beauty influencers have started doing this where they have their subscribers send them curated boxes. So one of the artists that I follow, she did it. They sent her all of the supplies they wanted her to use. She created art and then she sent the art back to them. So they got an original art piece. The way I thought we would do it is um, you would send me the stamp set, paper, whatever materials you want me to use, and I create, you know, two or three cards, and then I send 
everything back to you unless you say, hey, you know, this is a gift for you. Um, that way I get to use your stamp set and you get cards, but um, you're not having to spend a ton of money um, on supplies that um, I'll keep. So again, just something I have going on in my head and something that I'll need to think about more. But again, you'll just guys will have to let me know if that's something that you're even interested in. So next, let's talk about my holiday card series. I had hoped that I would start this last week, but better late than never, right? So what I've decided to do, again, I'm really trying hard not to overpromise, is I'm gonna to stick to a Wednesday, Friday upload schedule. I'm gonna upload at 10 a.m. Central, which is eight Pacific, nine Mountain, and 11 Eastern, and it's gonna be on Wednesdays and Fridays. Those are the two days of the week. I'm gonna do my best to guarantee that you will get a holiday card video. Now, I am gonna to try to upload a little bit more than that. I have a couple of series that I'm interested in starting that has really nothing to do with holiday cards cards but something that I've had in the works for probably two months now and um, so you'll probably get bonus con bonus you'll probably get some bonus content <laughs> you'll probably get some bonus content but you can expect to have uploads on every Wednesday and Friday for the holiday card series and that may be what I do going forward and um, it's something that I'll just have to play around with so yeah holiday cards are starting on Wednesday I'm so excited um, I have found a couple of new to me craft companies and I'm so excited for their Christmas releases. So you guys will see a haul in the next couple of weeks. So yeah, it's just going to be a whole, whole bunch. So I wasn't available this last week for videos because my week kind of got, 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 got away with me, from me. So Rob took last week off because I had a, an appointment with my rheumatologist and then I had an injection scheduled with my pain management doctor. And so he just went ahead and took that week off. So we decided we would go ahead and do our big Sam's shopping trip. So if you're unfamiliar, you haven't followed me forever, once, sometimes twice a year, Rob and I take a trip to Sam's and we stock up on meat. We've probably, this last time, I think we spent like $700 on meat and then we bring it home and I separate it and we vacuum seal it and then we eat on that for months. The last time we went was January and we probably had, we probably could have made it till mid-October but again he was off this week, we'd been putting the money aside so we went ahead and made a trip to Sam's. Um, with that though is, <laughs> it's a lot more than just going and getting the groceries. Number one, that was the first time I'd been in a grocery store since February. And then number two, it took all day Tuesday and all day Wednesday, um, it was a project to get all of that done. So on Tuesday, you may have noticed, I also got a haircut. Um, I, you guys know, I have a couple of autoimmune diseases. One of them causes extreme muscle weakness, as in like some days a fork or my toothbrush is too heavy for me to use. And it just got to be to the point where the hair had gotten to a point where I just couldn't hold my arms up long enough to wash it. And I, I really, I really had a hard time with this haircut. Normally I don't, normally it's just like it is what it is. But I think a lot of times what people don't share with you or you don't understand is that when some, when you, when you get a disease or you go through a major life change, something that affects every aspect of your life, you know, present and going forward in the future, you, you kind of grieve for some things that you were expecting or the life you had and the life you thought you were going to have. So this time kind of hit me in the feels and it caused a bit, a bout of depression for a couple of days. Um, I am feeling better. At the end of the day, it's just hair. It is what it is. <laughs> I look pretty good with short hair, so I just have to kind of get over it, but I am doing better. I did hurt my back Wednesday night. <laughs> I bent over, I was sitting on the bed, and I bent over to do something with my big toe, and I had bent over too long or something, but my back adjusted to where it was on a nerve, and whoo, I was in some excruciating pain, was not able to walk very well. I was due for a cervical injection on Thursday morning. It was going to be a three-level surgical injection, and it ended up being a three-level lumbar injection, uh, because my, they had to come get me out of the car with a wheelchair. So I have been trying to um, recuperate from that. It didn't take away my pain 100%, 
but it did lessen it enough that I can get away with wearing my Lattaking patches. So I'm feeling a little bit better. I apologize that there weren't any videos last week, but I just, I just couldn't. And what I'm hoping for with the two day schedule is it'll give me more time to not only create, but I can create you know, more in-depth projects or have an opportunity to explain a technique more in-depth. So you guys will have to let me know what you're most looking forward to for the holiday card series. And yeah. And then last but not least, <laughs> I hit 14,000 subscribers um, like last month. Unfortunately, I've lost about 100 subscribers and I'm back down in the 1300s. But I have already planned and already gathered stuff for a 14,000 subscriber giveaway. So we're going to go ahead and do it. <laughs> it is going to be open internationally. I do ask that you're 18 years or older or you get your parents permission to give out your address if you win. So I have, I'm not going to share with you with what I have because I want it to be a surprise, but I've got stamp sets and a die set from Hello Bluebird. Um, there's Simon Says Stamp. I've got um, the greeting form. I've got a couple from Anthony's Paper Crafts, the one that did the really cute um, cupcakes. I've got some paper. I've got some sequins. There's a whole lot of stuff that I'm going to send to you. There's going to be one winner. And all you have to do to enter is be subscribed and leave me a comment in the comments down below on this video letting me know when you subscribed. You don't have to be specific. You don't have to see January 24th, 1969 or anything like that. You can just put the year, you can put a month and year, um, whatever you want to do. Just let me know that you're subscribed and when you subscribed. And then for an extra entry, follow me over on Instagram and I'll have that link in the description box down below. So go over there, follow me, and then come back and leave a second comment with your Instagram handle. If you are already following me on Instagram, just leave a second comment with your Instagram handle down below. So I am gonna let this run for two weeks. I don't have my phone. <laughs> so I will leave all of the information linked down below. Um, so what will happen is I'll let it go for two weeks. I will use a random generator to generate the comment. I will respond to your comment if you are the winner. I'll give you 48 hours to get back to me with your address and then I will ship your um, package to you ASAP. There are some countries that I'm unable to ship to. Um, if you happen to be from one of those countries, we'll work something out and I'll send the package to, um, we'll end up having two winners, it just depends. So yeah, so thank you so much for joining me. I'm so excited to get started with the holiday card series. I know this video was a little long, but I, had, I felt like I had a lot to tell you. So yeah, I'm so excited that you're here with me and I can't wait to see um, what we can come up with going forward. So don't forget to subscribe, turn on your post notifications. That way, um, if I do happen to upload some bonus content, you will be notified. Um, however you have your notifications set up, whether that's an email or whether it's to come to your phone. Um, I'm not sure how you've done that, but that's how you'll get notified. And yeah, don't forget if you are a patron to head over there, excuse me, and check your messages. And that's it guys. I will see you Wednesday for day number one in my 2020 holiday card series. Bye for now. that I didn't have oh red lipstick all over my face please God make me a buddy so I'm gonna fall, fall away from me.